yeah, no, it was definitely better out there. I'm very happy to have come through that. Um, she definitely put up a fight, so uh, happy to come out with a win. Take us through that. We, we might as well go set by set. Just take us through the first set. Um, well, I definitely got a, a good start in the first set. I, I found my bearings quite quickly and I didn't really give her a chance to get into the, the match at that point. So, yeah, no, I gave myself a good lead, I think, on four love up. And, uh, yeah, no, I, I was able to close out the set at 5-2. So, yeah, that was a good first set. We move into the second and then you guys were just breaking back uh, against each other. Six consecutive uh, breaks, three each. Could you believe it? When it went on, you held serve, she held serve, she broke back, won the set. Is there a, almost a hint of disbelief about that? Um, not really, because I guess that's, that's the way tennis goes. I mean, that's not the first time or the last time that will ever happen to me. Um, but yeah, and I, I took it point by point, game by game. Obviously, it's, it's not ideal to be dropping your serve, but uh, I didn't let it phase me and uh, tried to stay calm and uh, yeah. <laughs> You were steely out there because we get into the third and deciding set, you go 4-1 down. Mm -hmm. Did you just retreat to that little bubble that you've spoken about this week and just regather yourself and not get phased and just move on? Yeah, no, definitely. I mean, that's a huge part of tennis, to be able to move on from each each point that you lose or each thing, just to be able to separate things. Otherwise, uh, you know, emotions can take over and uh, it's definitely, yeah, no, it's, it's, it definitely helped me out there today. How do you rate it as... A victory as a standalone victory, uh, the sort of guts that it took to get through that. Uh, do you feel very self-satisfied in that? Um, yeah, no, I'm definitely happy. I, obviously, uh, I, I would have been happy if I, I played maybe at points a little differently, a little better. But um, I think being able to win when you're not playing well is, is, is always a good thing. You know, so. Yesterday, uh, turns out that that victory over Joy, um, she's the highest ranked player you've beaten this year. Does that say a lot? about your form this year, uh, right now, on grass? Um, I'd say so. I mean, I, I have felt that I've been playing better and better uh, for the last number of weeks now, so it's nice that uh, you know a couple of results are coming through right now, but really, it, it really is just a process of continuing to work on what I'm working on, and so I'm not really paying attention to who I'm beating in terms of ranking-wise. <laughs> Next, you come up against uh, Pliskova. She's the only remaining seed in the competition. Uh, how do you view that as a semi-final? Definitely a tough one. I mean, both Pliskova sisters are, are great players, so it'll be a tough challenge, um, but I'm looking forward to it. So, um, yeah, we'll see how it goes tomorrow.